Welcome fellow Minecrafters, this is Araloth, and today we're starting a new Let's Play series using Better Minecraft Plus. Uh, this is a massive mod pack, it has over 250 mods, uh, it's been downloaded almost 100,000 times. Uh, it includes Tinkers, uh, Tetra, Create, Druidcraft, a ton of new creatures, dungeons, and structures. I, I'm really excited to try this out. Um, this is the world. Uh, it's just absolutely gorgeous, uh, the world we created here. Um, look at that sunrise. Wow. That is amazing. <laughs> uh, so, just kind of excited. This is called the Betterlands, it looks like. Um, just kind of checking out the area. Looks like... Uh, wait, what was that? What is this over here? Oh, wow. A little dungeon. Uh, let's see if we can grab this stuff before anything spawns. Um, yeah, yeah, I could be a little bit faster. I'm just, uh, yeah, kind of suck at parkour, too. I I did have a parkour instructor once. He literally drove me up the wall. Wow. <laughs> so funny. Um, let's see where we can go. Uh, we're just going to go up here and take a look around. I mean, this is amazing. Look at the, look at the terrain generation. It's just like, uh. Uh, incredible. I mean, it's it's come so far. Oh, what is that on the map? Huh. Uh-oh. Snakes. <laughs> I hear snakes. Ah, why, why does there have to be snakes? And two of them. That's just hysterical. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this little area here. I, I don't know what that structure is. It's it's kind of interesting, is it? Oh, it's above. Okay. Looks like a Death Star or some kind of... Um, I guess that's one of the new structures generated. Um, that looks really interesting. We don't have flight yet or any kind of jump. Uh, I guess we could nerd pull up to the structure. Uh, yeah, we're going to do that. <laughs> we're going to do that pretty soon because that, that would be really cool. Um, let's see what's over here. Uh, this also, this mod actually has tree harvester, um, which is very cool, so we can chop down uh, trees. Wow, look at that. Look at that flying, that airship. I, I have never seen a structure that big. I mean, not, not auto-generated. Uh, I don't know if this is, um... Just a one-off or if this is going to be like randomly created airships around the that would be really cool if this is gonna repeat oh look at these animals so we've got what is this an emu uh from a, from alex's mods okay uh that's pretty cool sounds like a cat purring i'm um, seeing some structures over here what wait what is that whoa that's that is pretty massive. <laughs> so we're already, we just started out and we're just seeing these um, ginormous structures. It's incredible. Look at that. Wow. Wow, that's unbelievable. I wonder if we could uh, just kind of explore a little bit. Hopefully it's not occupied. Oh, I see a spawner. Okay, we triggered an achievement. Let's grab this uh, stuff. Okay, he can't reach us. <laughs> um, I don't know what that. What happens in Vegas is the achievement. That's interesting. Uh, okay, so this is a bandit tower. Ha! Huh. More like aluminum bandits because they've been foiled. We just stole from the bandits. <laughs> Uh, let's see what what's over on this side. Wow. All those structures. I don't know if all those are occupied by bandits. Um, we probably want to make some armor. I was looking at uh, Plank's armor here. Let's try to go through the window here. Uh, maybe not. Whoa. What is that? Is he shooting fireworks? I'm... I'm going to guess that that would actually hurt us. <laughs> Let's 
go back. Whoa, okay, he overshot a little bit. He's not a really good aimer here. I think he went to Stormtrooper school for aiming, but... Okay, I don't know if he's running after me or what's up, but I think we need to make some armor. Uh, we want to get a little bit... Uh, we certainly want, <laughs> want a weapon before we start uh, breaking into this bandit tower complex. I imagine there's more than one spawner. Uh, we're gonna have to, yeah, we're gonna have to be really careful. Uh, yeah, we have no tools, so this is gonna be a slow, painful process. Hang in there. Uh, okay, let's let's go make some tools. Um, oh, a graveyard. Okay. Uh, hello, kangaroos. Uh, let's go ahead and get some wood, and what we'll do is we'll chop down these trees. Oh, oh no! Never punch a kangaroo! <laughs> First rule of Australian Fight Club. Ah! Are you getting a kick out of this kangaroo? If, ah! Ah! <laughs> he is hopping mad. Oh, what? Oh man. I should have run instead of talk. Uh, okay, so let's get back to that area. That was probably the shortest uh <laughs> let's play uh before someone's died um i think i broke some kind of record oh man all right let's go ahead and head back um yeah i didn't realize those kangaroos i think i hit a second kangaroo that's probably what did me in i should have run uh that's actually true in real life i think with with a kangaroo attack you're supposed to move out of its kicking range i think that's the the advice whoops um, and instead of hitting it, I should have run. So now we know not to hit the kangaroos. And I didn't mean to. It was obviously an accident. I was trying to chop down that tree. Um, and we had no armor to protect us. So, yeah, we were basically kangaroo fodder. Uh, let's see. Let's find our way back. Okay, so this, there's a... Um, a recover an inventory recovery mod i think in this pack uh i don't remember what it's called but uh always grateful for those so we won't lose all the stuff that we just looted um phew, okay right over that ravine that probably goes all the way down okay yeah we're just gonna head back and try to get uh I guess find out where we die. There should be an axe, so oh, raspberries. Well, these are always good. We can plant these uh, by whatever base we set up. I'm going to try to use the trees here to cross over. I'm just looking at the mini-map on the top right. It looks like uh, the X marks the spot where we got pummeled by the uh, kangaroos. Maybe this wasn't such a good idea. <laughs> Trying to wade through this tree. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I am really impressed with uh, the terrain generation. This is uh, more snakes. I hope that hawk eats them. Uh, let's see. just beautiful look at those rays of sunshine it's amazing i'm using the uh the complimentary shader pack i think if you go to the website for better minecraft plus uh you can grab a link to that you'll need to install optifine uh you need a fairly beefy computer i think i turned off the specular lighting what is this Fossil rock, okay. I can't get that yet because we unwisely did not create tools right away. I was kind of just taken aback by, oh, look at that. Should have taken a, yeah, I should take a screenshot of that. That's amazing. I mean, it's just incredible how far Minecraft has progressed over the years. Um, okay, here's our, uh, okay. 
off. They don't remember that I attacked them, which is good. Uh, there's our tree stump. Um, where's the body? Where's the body? Did I miss it? Um, we're right over the X. Oh, okay. So we're here. Look, I kind of blend in with the, uh, oh, my head's inside the, uh, the dirt. That's great. Okay, so yeah, this is good. So there's a court. There's a mod called Corpse, and allows you to recover everything. Um, let's look around. Yeah, I almost made the same mistake. I didn't check for kangaroo. Apparently, uh, we don't want to chop those down. Uh, okay, so what we're gonna do is uh, we'll go ahead and make a crafting table, and we'll make some tools. Uh, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start with an axe. Actually, all we need is a wooden axe, and I think we'll have as much wood as if, if I um, remember tree harvester. I think we'll be able to chop down as much as we want. Um, yeah, yeah. So you sneak uh, when you when you chop down a tree, uh, you hold down the shift key and sneak at the same time, and it'll chop down the entire tree all at once. Um, and it's actually pretty, yeah, it's pretty generous on the durability. Um, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Uh, okay. Ghost. All right, ghost. Ghost. There you go. Man. That was, uh, <laughs> I did not expect that. I don't know if that's because, I don't know if that came from the graveyard or, um, hmm. Yeah, we probably want to get underground, I think. Um, so let me go ahead and store this stuff. And I'll muddle through this. Just give me a second. All right, so we're going to store some of this stuff, and then I think we're going to make a little hobbit hole to hide in uh, until daylight. Because uh, there's just too much stuff out here trying to kill me. <laughs> this is crazy. But look, we already have an ender pearl. We have gunpowder. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm really happy with the uh, loot. The loot is great. It's just uh, kind of a dangerous area. Uh, so let's go ahead and make some armor, too. See anything else? So, uh, you see, I already searched up Plank's chest, which is the uh, the chest armor. Oh, Plank's. I guess it doesn't show all the armor. All right. Uh, so I'll go ahead and make a full set of armor. And you know, this isn't bad for wood. It's yeah, it's you know, it's very basic armor, but uh, it, it's better than nothing, right? Uh, very cheap and with you know combining that with the tree harvester we have as much wood as we want I think there is yep there is a bone sword and that looks like it has a decent you know at least for early game a decent number of hits five okay um, let's go ahead and make something to dig with and we will go ahead and start to collect some cobble um, and maybe build a little underground hobbit hole for now. And then we're going to assault this uh, bandit tower. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I definitely want to see what loot they have in there. I think we, uh, uh, we're we going to find some good stuff in there. Uh, I don't know how f it looks like it just goes straight up above the clouds. Uh, so we'll go ahead and uh, kind of get down to cobble at least. That's what I'm trying to do. Um, looks like we've got some terracotta. There we go. Okay. We'll keep building. Oh, oh no! Where did he come from? Ghost, I hope you get lost in a fog so you'll be missed. 